so guys in this video we will see about the user permissions and you can see you can see the permissions of that user using the command sudo l so let's go ahead and type sudo l so this is the uh, content of the sudo errors file so this user may run the following commands on this host as a root user with no password and this binary so that means whenever i run this binary as a root there will be no password prompted so let's say sudo uh, usr bin uh, man so you can see i'm running this command and if i hit enter and you can see it it is asking directly what manual page do you want instead of asking the password so okay now i can uh, take advantage of these commands uh, to get the root share so you can see this is the website where you can find all the binaries and how to use them to leverage into the root shell so you can check out this github uh, gtfo bins so okay all right now let's see the first binary so if top sorry it's uh, sudo usr uh, spin sorry so so now you can see we are reasoning now what you need to do is type the exclamation and then type bin slash sh and hit enter now you can see we got the shell who am i root now let's exit this so since we'll be uh, we will we'll be getting back to this if top so or let's press h and type escape and then press h and press q so q will exit so that's how you use the if top normally enter that uh, enter the if top and then type the exclamation bin sh and the find command so find command will it has an option called exec so let me say ls now what we are going to do is uh, we are specifying this ovpn file so whenever uh, find command finds this one and we will say execute this command find in the current directory and name is my vpn dot ovpn so upon finding this file execute this one execute who am i and you need to put the uh, semicolon backward slash semicolon escape character so you can see we got the root uh, the thing why we are searching for one file is uh, it will exactly output only once because it is only one file if there are 10 files and if you are searching for them this command will get executed those many number of times now you can say bin bash so we got the root shell so let's do the nano so i actually i think uh, this escape sequence won't work with nano so let's see nano uh, let's click on this nano you can see here this is how you punish it so the spell environment variable you need to set that environment variable to bin sh and then you need to type bin sh and we need to press control t that executes this i think so so let's do that bin sh now press control t so you, you can see we got the root shell so that's how you do with nano uh, now press no let's say 
sudo manager and vim so vim is a uh, very simple one so press escape and then press colon shift to press colon and then you can type the command so w for save and q for quit and then we are going to execute the shell uh, put the exclamation mark bin sh so we got the shell exit now press press q press q okay now let's see the manual page uh, let's uh, find the manual page for ls so now as it is uh, press exclamation mark bin sh and hit enter so we got the shell and awk i think we need to call some system command or system function i don't know so you can just simply copy this so begin and we are calling the system of bin sh okay So we got the shell and exit and using the res command so now type as it is bin sh so we got the shell and exit and ftp so it's i'm sorry uh, i did not quit properly ftp and hit enter now it will ask for commands now put this escape sequence and bin sh we got the shell exit and again exit so the nmap binary nmap has the option interactive so let's uh, grep for interactive So you can see now we can execute the commands. So I'm type the bin sh and you'll get the shell. And Apache 2 it will not give any uh, any privileged shell because there is no method for that. But they have asked uh, uh, about how you might use this program and so I tried different options it did not work and I used this uh, debug mode but it did not work so thing you cannot do because even in GTFO bins it is not available so you can search for Apache So there are no matches so all right now don't worry uh, we have last one more okay more i think we need to get the more lines let's search for more 
let's click on that so we need we are setting the term environment variable to more hc profile okay Okay, I think we have normal user. Okay, now, okay, we need to give this. Okay, I'm sorry. I don't know why I'm getting this error. So okay, uh, we have so many options. We have used so many binaries uh, to get the privileged shell. So whenever you, it's uh, worth checking for the our local privileges whether we can run any binary as a highest or higher privilege user with no password. 